Welcome to Home Brewing TV. Today we're going to be reviewing Anvil Brewing Equipment's new Forge High Performance Burner. Stick with us. this new burner is the, uh, the burner assembly itself. Uh, this thing is supposed to output 72,000 BTUs per hour. Um, but other than that, everything else is identical, which is great because I, uh, I love the last one. Uh, I've had the last uh, burner they had uh, for a little over a year now. Nothing wrong with it whatsoever. It works great. Uh, the little paint is coming off, but that's to be expected. But uh, let's get this assembled and uh, see what it looks like put together. start at 100 degrees which is 99 99.5 all right y'all wouldn't want me to flame throw this 100 go for it so we are cranking this thing open and we're gonna see how fast we can get to boil temperature So Mike, now we just finished doing the test between the Anvil High Performance Burner, which is the old one, mm -hmm. and the new Forge Burner, which is this one. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, this one got hot faster, yes, about it 15 minutes faster. Yes, I think that's right. I think it uh, have the amount of time, yeah. about uh, just a little roughly. short of half, roughly, uh, to get the boil. What's your opinion? My opinion is a favorable one, very positive. Um, specifically, I like the fact that this burner here has a variable regulator that really permits you to go from zero to a hundred. Now, that's an analogy here. There's no zeros, ones, tens, right. or a hundred, but basically it's a continuously type of variable regulator, whereas opposed to the other regulators with their just a low click, high, click, you know, you just, you, you get a whole uh, amount of setting here that permits, yeah. that permits more gas to be used. Um, now this, this is the same regular that they have on the uh, the Blickman Hellfire, right? On the, I, I believe that is correct. Um, but in a smaller unit like this, yeah. it gives you the benefit of the Hellfire in a um, less expensive burner. That's important because if you need to get to boil quicker, this is going to do it at a cheaper price. And uh, if price is important to you, I, I this is the way I'd roll. Yeah, yeah. Their new design for the burner assembly itself uh, makes it a far more efficient use of gas. I think. Okay. Um, this one you can because of the regulator, I believe you can output seventy 
72 to 7400 something like that it's in the low to mid 70,000 British thermal units BTUs uh, 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 output and because that extra heat is there you're going to get your water heated up quicker which right. would help Paul yeah. in some cases where Somebody I know and brew with has uh, sometimes, you know, forgotten about sparge water. I, <laughs> are you referring to the fact that maybe sometimes I would get close to the end of the mash and say, hey, the sparge water hasn't been heated up? That I can't that imagine that was, would happen. That's what I was referring to. I can't to. imagine that would happen. If. If well, that were to happen, Mike. If it were to if, happen. So theoretically, if that yes. were to happen. It's conditional, yeah. This burner would be helpful. It, very helpful. It would save a lot of time. Long story <laughs> short, it saves time. <laughs> this is a good burner to save time due to the fact that you can output uh, in, with this regulator um, a lot more gas out to the burner, which will heat things up much quicker. Saves you time and it saves your beer. Yeah, well, I thank you for bringing that up. No problem. Um, other than, so, so other than the regulator mm -hmm. uh, being new, which mm -hmm. I like, and the, the, the burner itself being mm -hmm. new, which is helpful. Yes. Um, the unit itself is pretty much the same as the uh, high performance burner they had before. Yes. And I love it still. Mm -hmm. They've got the built-in heat shield. Yes. Which saves all up of your front. ball valves and everything you've Correct. got in the front of your pot. Correct. Um, it's a tripod design, which is very fantastic. Steady. Very steady. The self-leveling feet. Um, this, as before, and I'm glad they carried it over to the new unit. Mm -hmm. It's it's a fantastic design. I really really like it. Yes, it's a good design. And uh, for five to ten gallon brews, this is perfect. This heated up the water a lot quicker. Yeah. And um, it's a lower price point, which is important. And I think that uh, this this product here is really um, a very good product. Yeah, it, it, it meets a lot of needs. Absolutely. I, I, I like the fact that it heats up things a lot quicker. Yeah. Um, good job. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed the review, please give us a thumbs up, share the video. Uh, if you've uh, not been with us before, and this is your first video, well, welcome, come on on board. Hit that subscribe button. Uh, once you've done that, hit the bell icon. That'll allow you to get notifications anytime we do do uh, updates and such. Yeah, you know, new mm -hmm. new content. New content. Um, if you have any questions about the review, uh, about the tests we've done, uh, go ahead and put those in the comments below. We'll be happy to answer those for you. Uh, we'll put a link to the product in the description below, also for you. Um, but that's uh, that's all I really got for you. So uh, yep. hey, until next time, keep brewing, my friends. You want to do one more? If you want to. Let's Let do choose. one more. Okay. Let's do one more for the fun of Because Al's enjoying this. Al, you laughing? He's not even paying attention. That's good. Oh, I'm not even paying attention. That's all right. right. Don't, you shouldn't. Yeah, don't pay attention. Just <laughs> working on my wine. There you go. All We're right. working on our beer, and it's, Perfect. it's it's showing, too. All right. One more time here. Okay. I should have shaved before I came here. Yeah, well, let's wait. Let's we just I like the fact that you're just so rough and gruff and... Manly. I wouldn't go with that far to say you're manly. <laughs> Paul, don't you want to know about that? Uh, you know, just hush. Just you just all that. You just do your thing. All right.